Hey, didn't even know you were there. <laughs> Just fixing this finally. This has been on the heater controls for uh, a few months. And before that, you had to turn it by your hand. Oh, we can't have that. It's been an absolutely stressful day. I am chipping the worst of the worst of the worst of the worst. Now, you, they, uh, man, that motor's not revved on all the way. There we go. Um, when I say worst of the worst, it's garbage. It's no fun to chip. Now, there is some that chip worse, worster, worse wood. Uh, Matt texted me the other day, my buddy Matt, with their whole tree chipper. They were chipping some nasty garbage. But when it comes to flail, this stuff is, uh, pull, I'm pulling my hair out. And my, my spot that's going bald in the back is getting more and more and more. And that's not what we need at all. That's not what we need. <laughs> the first two loads went great. This is my second one. The first two loads went great. I mean, considering, and this third load has taken us me too. Four, four hours? Yeah. 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 Eh. I had to change a couple hoses on the grapple. And uh, we got that done. I got that done. Then uh, I had some stuff get stuck in the conveyor. Oh, come on. <laughs> this is harder than it looks. Just one of them days. So, what basically, let me explain to you what's happening. Oh, hush, Will. We're working. Hot. Hot. So, what we have is yesterday we chipped some oak. Today we're chipping kind of the end of it. And what has happened was, is we. All the stuff that could be put through the slasher, we've kind of got to that point where everything now is like this bit. So, <laughs> uh, I know Mike's out there, somebody else is out there trying to buck up logs with a chainsaw, but uh, yeah, it, stress is running high. That chipper guy back in the chipper in He's not doing so swell. I have been doing nothing impressive today. I do got a weight like right now on wood. And uh, it's no fun. Basically, I got to put wood uh, through this flail. And when you put it through the flail, I got about 30 feet. 20? I don't know. About 30 feet from the back of the chipper to the chipper disc so I'm putting it through a tunnel down there a big hole a big old tunnel and I can't see it so every stick of wood you have to keep that in your brain and you can feel when it goes through the knives and uh, I give you a little smooth vibrations so once you can tell that that chunks through then you can feed something else maybe and the problem is, is when something you think goes through it doesn't go through and you try to get another chunk through then you get two chunks stuck down in there and you don't know where they're at or what's what and it can cause a lot of stress so basically it's been uh, one of those days but we've, we've been making it let me get this done let me get this tightened on here I think we're, I think we're getting somewhere on this. Oh, yeah. I gave her the old chipper guy torque. We'll see how long that button stays on there. The old turn knob. But yeah, it has been just horrendous day to day. Pulling out my hair. The little bit that I have left. And you guys probably want to see what I'm chipping. So once I get some wood up here, I'll get you spun around and you can see some action. Sound fun?
sound like a blast? You guys might as well just sit back and just enjoy my stress level is at a maximum right now. Irritation, stress, um, it's up there. I mean, it's ceiling high. So, I'll be happy when today ends. So I still have to figure out what I'm doing today. I don't know, I don't think we're moving today. I gotta talk to the truck driver and try to see what's going on after I get him loaded. But she's pretty close to loaded finally. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. He's pretty close. The chipper's kind of... Uh, the hood's broke again. We rewalded at the first video. That That's broke again, so now that has to get rewalded. And... The grapple... A piece of steel broke off, I see. It's broke. No way, I'm that good of an eye. No. Um, maximum stress level. I'm ready to go home. Well, you know what I'm going to do? I want to come up with something besides just keep rolling because I don't want to keep rolling. I want to get out of it. I want to keep rolling on home. <laughs> um, but we're going to fight through this. I got I got a truck sitting out here. The truck's been sitting out here. Time check. 3 o'clock. The truck has been sitting out there since 9 o'clock this morning. Waiting on me. So. It's been a uh, not so adventurous day. One of those days where it's just like, you know, yeah. I'm going to stop telling you how bad it is. And I'm just going to show you how bad it is because I, I can see the wood coming up and it's squirrely and crooked and nasty and anything but straight. It's pretty much. And long. It is short and squirrely. So, here we go. I'm going to shut you off. We'll get rolling. Finish this load up real quick. What do you guys want to go on? The grapple? Could put you out there. We'll see.
like that right there. What? You don't think that chipper guy can't sharpen a chainsaw? <laughs> I can't.